Hello everyone, my name is the Ammonite, or Emma for short. Welcome back to the channel, and this is the 24th game in the 31 Days of Horror that we are currently doing on the channel. Today we are playing Amanda the Adventurer. I was going to get straight into it. Dear Riley, if you are reading this, it means you won't see me again unless it's in the next life. I wish I could have told you everything. I don't know how much time I have, and there is still so much I have to do before I'm gone. This letter serves two purposes to say goodbye and to bequeath you to my house in Kensdale. This next part may be a mistake, and God forgive me if it is. When you settle in the song in the attic, I can you pass on to you. Look for a tape, but know that once you watch it, there's no turning back. Stay safe, my dear. With you always. And Kate. Oh. Okay, I need to say immediately, I... I am fully aware, like, the twist in this game. Um... Sorry to say it straight out there. I do know a bit, I'll, quite a bit about this game. I mean, um, all I've seen though is I've seen the original, like, when the game was in beta. Like, because to begin with, it wasn't like this. There was no attic. It was just, um, you would load it into the game, I'm pretty sure, and that was it. And you would play through the tape. Nothing else happened. I f hate that. Um, in the kitchen. So I am not too sure what to expect. Dear Mrs. Park, I know it's been a long time since you've seen me, but I swear the library was sometimes the only place I felt safe. I'll always be grateful to you for that. For being someone I knew I could trust, need that again to trust. Two years ago, my little brother Jordan disappeared, just poof, gone. My parents were never the same, and how now they're gone too. They just didn't get over their grief. I broke their hearts and eventually I killed them. The police figured someone snatched Jordan off the streets. That some crazy guy lured him away. A freak occurrence, you know, a regular old suburban tragedy. But I know there's more to it. I know you I know you know it too. I thought I was alone. Nobody believed me when I tried to bring up. But I heard about the kind of research you do. The kind that normal people don't do. I know. Maybe it's just rumour, but here I am. Screw records, behaviour. Make up to review cold cases. <sighs> I know there's definitely going to be a lot of lore in this game. I don't know what I picked up there. Um, I get the feeling that I accidentally picked up the key through the wall. Um, yeah, I know there's going to be a lot of lore in this game now, so I'm looking forward to seeing that, but let's continue with these. Used to watch that show, you know, it was really sweet at first. I remember they even used to tell families of young kids to watch it. It was. I don't know. I don't know. Wholesome, I guess. And then it just got weird. I find Jordan standing in front of the TV like was in a trance. It was like that little girl was talking to him. She said some really weird stuff. I know most of the people around here don't believe in the kind of work you do. Not at the library. The other kind of work. They just don't want to force the truth that something really evil was here. <sighs> Can we meet and talk? I don't want to write anymore here. I feel like someone is watching me. Sincerely, Joanne Cook. When did it change? Building is still there. Too risky. Catherine Park. Energy transfer would see schedules. Don't be a stranger, I'm your neighbour. Hi, Aunt Kate, thank you so much for the rose skates. Dad and I went skating at the lake yesterday, fell down, but don't tell him I told you that. I can't wait to see you on some vacation, but Riley. So there's de there is definitely a lot more lore in this. Um, I know I'm stolen, uh, but I just want to like check my surroundings before I do anything. Guess there's no going back. Hi, I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Today we're going to make an apple pie. My favorite is peach pie. What's your favorite kind of pie? Lamb, chest, pecan, peach. Chess, chess, peach, high pie, chess, pie. What's something that means cheese? Um, I'm gonna say pecan. Mmm, that sounds delicious. Today we're going to make an apple pie. First, 
we need to cut the apples. Hmm, do you know what we can use to cut the apples? Knife, hammer, spoon, spork. Mm, knife? Fork? Good job! We can use a sharp knife. I don't remember any uh, of this. I don't think we're supposed to do that by ourselves. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. Look, I'm a pirate. <laughs> that doesn't seem safe. Okay, Willie, let's cut the apple. That was hard. We have almost everything we need to make our pie. We just need some sugar. Hmm, do you know where we keep the sugar? Is it in the pantry, the refrigerator, or the sink? Okay, I want to say immediately, I don't remember any of this in the game. Um, I don't remember how the game started when I first seen it, like, made. Nope, try again. Sink. Don't you want to help me? Cupboard. So, where's the sugar? Oh, God. Great! Let's make a pie! Hmm, can you smell the apples and cinnamon? Okay, it's time to bake a pie. First, preheat the oven to 425... I don't think we should be using the oven by ourselves. We should always ask a parent to help. I'm not sure where they are right now. <laughs> We're on our own, Willie. First, preheat the oven to 425 degrees. Then, put the apples into the pie tin. Now, put it in the oven and bake it for 40 minutes. Our pie is ready! I can't wait to eat it! Willy, let's have some pie! Okay, that wasn't there before. Um... God, so, I'm sorry, so much has changed from this, like, I, like, I remember, I'm pretty sure, like, people have seen it, but, like, I, all I remember is, like, it went to, there was no such thing as baking a pie in the original, it was, like, I remember a butcher, what the fuck was that, there was a butcher, there was a playground, and there was a few other things. Okay, so I'm assuming it just wants me to bake a pie. A proper pie. So many questions for this game, like, what is gonna happen? Okay, I'm assuming I'm looking for apples. Okay, well, there's an apple there. I'm really glad that, like, I mean, I know, I know the twist. Um, I know what's coming. I say I know the twist. The twist has probably changed, but I do know like sort of what Amanda is and what it's about. Um, but I'm really looking forward to like learning more. I am fucking hate that. I don't know if that door was there before. I'm not sure. Um. Yeah, I, I know the twist. But I'm not entirely sure. Also, that's a peach. I don't know if that's gonna work. Should say 425, didn't you? 
No, four seventy-five. Let me rewatch the tape and right, so four twenty-five and forty minutes. Four twenty-five, forty minutes. Yes. Okay. In your neighborhood. What do we have think to do? Okay. Hi, friend. I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. What do you like best about your neighborhood? That's great! I like that there are so many friends in my neighborhood. Does a, Today, does a dead body. I want to send something special to my friend. First, I need to go to the store to buy them a card. Do you know where the store is? <laughs> That's not the store, silly. It says store on it. Post office? I'm kind of in a hurry here. Ooh. Good job! Let's go to the store. Let's pick out a card. My friend helped me when Okay, um sorry for the weird cut. Uh I had to go do something. I was sad. What kind of card should I send them? I forgot the question. So I was picking up an Amazon package. It's not their birthday. Do you think that's what they need? Yes. What do you say when someone helps you? Um, new Blabot, only £1,503.25. What a bargain. Great! I found the perfect card! Time for the next errand! When friends do nice things, it's important to thank them. I want to get my friend a special treat. Can I have a special treat? I want to get my friend a special treat. Where can I buy a treat for my friend? Wow, your friends must love your treats from the post office. I hope all the treats are stale by the time we get there. Can you show me where to go? What's this? Also, I don't know. I like I like messing with. Good her. job. Let's go get that tree. Mmm. Everything smells so good. I want to buy my friend some buy my friend some cookies. Can you show me where the cookies are? I recognize that from the original. Cake. I don't think my friend will like that. Cupcakes. I can't mail that to my friend. You can mail a cake. I want the cookies! Ooh. Those look so tasty! We just have one more stop in the neighborhood. The package is ready for my friend. They live pretty far from me, so we need to mail it. Wow, it's getting late. Most of the stores are closed. We probably can't send that now. I have to send this to my friend. It's time to go to the post office. Let's send this package to my friend. Their name is... Wait, I what if it's, don't what if it's remember. To me? Can you help me? We can come back tomorrow. What, what if it's to you me? You don't have to send that now. No, I have to send this to my friend. Help me. Who does the package need to go to? Ooh. Emma, Amanda, Ryan, Joanne. I think... Wait, if I say Joanne, it'll send me one it. Ryan? No, that's not my friend's name. Liam. You have to know their name! Oh, it's Kate. Great work! Now we can send this to my friend. I hope she likes the cookies. I have so many questions about this game. Wow. 
hat. Was ist Okay, so that's obviously a puzzle. I have so many questions for this game. Uh, like, I'm guessing. Uh, so your aunt died. The joy of cooking sheep. Okay, that's mumbled. Um, in in per us uh, in Pustapai land disuvian tax fraud. Something about tax fraud. Um, okay, so there is a lot of puzzles in this game. Um, I don't know. I've just got so many theories about what about what this could be. Like, um. I'm willing to bet that the tapes were made by someone. Um, kind of reminds me of like some 1999 kind of thing. Caledon Local 21. Creepypasta. Which, once again, shout out to... I'll say shout out. Um, shout, oh God, I can't kind of think. Another, like, thank you to... Creepcast for telling me about 1999 and explaining it. I say thank you, like, they were directed at me, it was directed at everyone. I'm gonna look up this um, piano because. So apparently it has to do with the stores, so it would have been the card store, the bakery, and then the thing. Oh no, accidents. I feel bad for looking that up, but I would not have been able to figure that out. But yeah, I wonder, like, I'm just, I just want to say my theories before we go into this next tape. I'm, because I do know a little thing about it, but I don't, all I, like, the original game, I think it was the beta, it did not have any of this. It was just, um, like, three things, and then it was, like, the plot twist at the end. I say the plot twist, um, something happens. Oh god. So I'm wondering if this kid, Jordan, got sucked into the TV. Um, oh no, I fully read this. My parents never said now they're gone too. They just didn't get over the grief. It broke their hearts and eventually it killed them. So they, they probably like ended their lives. Can't really say the other word for YouTube. The police figured someone snatched Jordan off the street. But there's something more to it. Oh wait, no, I did read that. I just didn't remember. Um, Maybe like Catherine. So I'm I'm assuming like because that note was like so your so your aunt died. I'm assuming my my aunt died, and this was her this is her research on this like on these tapes, and now she's trying to figure out like what um. Now she's like left her research to me, kind of like another game. That I'm not gonna say what game it is, but because I don't want to oh, spoil it. It's you. Whatever you do, don't... 
<laughs> oh no! Wooly had an accident! An accident is when something bad happens, but it's not anybody's fault. Accidents can happen in your house, at school, at the playground. You can get hurt almost everywhere. Yeah, but his bone is sticking out. At 3.45 this afternoon, we were playing and Wooly tripped and fell. I, I didn't try. Where on Wooly does it look like he got hurt? Well, I just I just read that down 345. Um, his nose. Oh, his head. That part of Wooly looks fine. His eye. Hurry up! He's hurt! His tongue. Hurry up! He's hurt! His knee. That's right! Wooly hurt his knee. Who can help when you are hurting? Um, doctor. Let's take Wooly to the hospital to see a doctor. Hmm, which room should we go into to find the right doctor to help Wooly? I don't like this. Oh. <laughs> Phone time. I'm gonna put that in as soon as I can. I don't think that doctor can help Wooly. The hot one. Willie's in a lot of pain. This one? Please help me get to the right doctor. Sorry, I just want to see what happens if I mess up. Come on, let's get Willie fixed up. Amanda, this really hurts. When is the doctor going? The doctor isn't here right now. Let's see how we can help Willie. Which tool can we use to check Wooly's injury? The heart monitor, the x-ray machine, or the scale? Oh, shit. Once again, I like seeing, like, what messes up. You no, know, silly. <laughs> it's our blood. The heart monitor. I'm scared. What should we use? Wait, so that, that's a heart for the heart monitor. What is that, then? I've got a theory, what if Wooly is, um, what if Wooly is, uh, trying to think, what if Wooly is, uh, ooh, clock, what if Wooly is Jordan, and TikTok, TikTok, oh, thank you for getting rid of all my research, that, well, sorry, my, my aunt's research that I was going to look at. Okay, I want to try out these times. Um, so the first one I want to try out is 10.50. I don't know what that did. Um, and then I want to try out the clock. I mean, I would, I think it's that clock, but I want to test it out on this one. Okay, I don't think that's gonna. Do you probably need an extra hand for that? Um, so I was aimed at four. This was aimed at... Okay, so there was nothing then. Oh, hello. There's a soul here. Where's the birthday girl? Usually my mom holds my treat money. <laughs> well, I'm come on, Lauren, we have a special surprise for you. Okay. Here's what I had. <laughs> Who's ready for ice cream and cake? She's busy with her best friend. Is that show on 24-7? It's like she didn't even hear me. Then we need to talk about some new TV. <laughs> you know what, hold on. 
Let me try. I, I want to want to capture the big surprise on video. <laughs> Lauren, honey, we got cake and ice cream. We got your favorite mint chocolate chip. Come on, baby. We can watch Amanda another time. It's so much fun. Lauren, buy your own. Everything okay? Lauren. Mm, Lauren. I love mint chocolate chip. What? That is so fucked up. That is so creepy. Oh my god. So it was, it was listening to her. Catching up with Sam. Sam Colton wasn't expecting to be a father to a town icon. But last summer it became clear that his public access series Amanda Adventure and its characters were something very special for his self-professed struggling writer. It all started with his adopted daughter and new outlook on life. Recently, I caught up with Sam over a stack of the Sunflower Diner's famous strawberry banana cakes. We chatted about the value of imagination, everyday adventures, and what the future may have in store for Amanda. Lacey, Sam, not a day goes by when my kiddos aren't talking about Amanda and her adventures. Did you even dream that this little show would be a big hit? Sam, little show is right, isn't it? But I think there's something elegant in simplicity. We may not have the budget for a big production, but I truly believe there is a soul that transcends that. I'm humbled by the way the town has embraced my something I really am. Ooh, I I am loving this. I'm I'm getting into this. God, I wish I could just oh. I would love to do like more videos on this. Um, I would love to know more of the secrets. I mean, I'm not ending the video right now. Um, once again, I'm gonna have to look up the clock puzzle because I am a bit stupid. <laughs> Oh shit. I was expecting a freaking jump scare there. Um wait, 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 I didn't get a hand. Oh there it is. That must have been what like clipped through the screen when like at the start of the got the start of the episode. Set to five fifteen. I'm just a little bit dumb, aren't I? Oh shit. Save 826. Well, you know, there's nothing wrong with taking a picture now and then remembering it later. It's just typical it would disappear, wouldn't it? everything rots yeah I would um, love to make more videos on this or um, even I'll play it in my own time and get all the trophies but um, I'll see how well this video Hi, does I'm Amanda and I'm Wooly it's such a nice day for a picnic what's your favorite food to eat at a picnic Oh, I don't like that at all. Uh, Amanda, what's that smell? I've never smelled anything like that. Hmm, I don't know, Wooly. You're right, it's a bad smell. What do you think is making that bad smell? You. No, that looks fine. You. Are you doing this on purpose? What is making that bad smell? This. You! You're right! This sandwich is stinky because it's rotting. This tree stump is rotting too. 
Do you know why? Things rot when they are not alive anymore. Do you know what the opposite of alive is? <laughs> What's this? Hoppy. Hoppy? Look at the tree stump. If it's not alive, what is it? It's cool. I don't think we should be talking about this. It's Are safe. Are you afraid to think about it? It's Kate. Are you afraid to think about it? Twitch? Are you afraid to think about it? It's hiding. Are you afraid to think about it? Okay, we went through all the options and nothing's changed, so... That's right! The tree stump is dead! Dead is the opposite of alive! Good job! Men can die if they don't get enough light or water. Or if they get a disease. Let's go back to our nice picnic. Animals can die in different ways, too! Look at poor Mr. Fox! He is dead and rotting! What do you think killed him? The gun, the knife, or the poisonous berries on this bush? You did it. Okay, um, I know it's definitely the poisonous berries, but I'm gonna say the gun. I don't think that was it. The knife? No, it wasn't that. Look at his funny tongue. <laughs> He's silly. What killed him? The gun. Wouldn't it be nice if he could tell us? Mr. Fox, what made you die? Okay, so she is getting pissed off. It was the ugly old bear trap. Mr. Fox didn't even know what got him until it was too late. Amanda, this has gone too far. I don't like this. We Get the gun, shoot up. so many things today. A riding sandwich, a riding tree stump, and silly old riding Mr. Fox. Feels far away. Amanda, nothing is rotten here. What do you think? Do you think that everything rots? Of course not, Amanda. I'm not asking you. Answer my question. You don't have to answer that. Maybe. Why won't you answer my question? <sighs> wait, 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 wait. I've got another theory. What if, like, when she said, I feel like I'm rotting, but it's far away. What if her... What if the guy that created this show... Killed his daughter? I don't know I don't know if he has a daughter. I'm just, like, theorizing here. What if he killed his daughter, and her body is, like, miles and miles away from this TV? Buried somewhere, and she's rotten. I, that might be correct, that might not be. I'm All I want to say is, I don't know anything about the lore in this game that's just my theory you have to tell me what's this one well bah. <laughs> don't you want to be my friend please answer my question yes 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 yes, yes. i think it might be too late Oh. Ooh. I remember that. <laughs> Holy shit. Wow. That was that was a cool that was a much cooler ending. Um, I should see what's in this safe real quick. It was A25, wasn't it? A26? My camera is a bit blurry. There we go. What was in this one? 
Red, orange, beige, lilac. What is this? Is this for you? No. Well, that was Amanda the Adventurer. Um, so, she just comes out the, the basement. So, attic. So does that, does that mean she's literally like under this, underneath right now looking for me? Or was that why like the ant put all of this stuff up here? To hide from that monster? So many questions. Um, ah, so there's six tapes in total to find. Um... If this video does well, and if anyone actually wants me to continue the story, um, let me know. I'll give it about, um, I'll give it a week, or till the end of like the 31 days of horror, and if anyone said yes, I would love to see you do another episode, um, I will do it, I will make this into a series, if not, I will just play it on my own time, because I love this game. Um, I mean, at first, when I first seen it, it was so, it was cool, but then I didn't think I would get it. But now that I see like it's all like this, that is just awesome. So many secrets. Um, I'm wondering if I did actually tell her that she's rotten, if Woolly would have survived and that thing wouldn't have came for me. Um, but who knows? Well, you someone knows out there <laughs> that's played the game. Um, but thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy what you see today, don't forget to like and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss a future upload of mine. And I'll see you guys in the next video that I do. Goodbye!